This was the first modern Mercedes, and they were calling it at that time Simplex, which should underline the easy handling and easy maintaining of this vehicle. Due to the uh, now steel chassis and the longer wheelbase, it was possible to put the center of gravity further down, and this uh, helped a lot in regard to driving safety and driving stability. Now how it came to the name Mercedes, Emil Jelinek, who has received one of the first of these vehicles, and he himself gave his vehicle the name of his 11 years daughter, Mercedes. After this, this has been uh, taken by the by Daimler Motorengesellschaft, and all vehicles are called now Mercedes. One of the most authentic vehicles the company has ever, ever came up was here in 1936, this 500K Special. K stands for compressor. Now the first time was quite a lot of chrome applications, Bosch headlights, Bosch driving lights, and Bosch wingers. From this vehicle, uh, the company has built 25 units. Two are still in our hands. Now you might ask what was the price at that time for this vehicle without having exact figures, but people telling you the value of this vehicle was at that time like a three-family house in the finest suburb of Berlin, Dahlendorf. I would kindly ask you to have a look, please, to the dashboard. This was really a masterpiece. The engineer, they have not lost their focus in regard to sportiness and elegance, which can be seen here by this 300 SL. Volkswagen at that time cost roughly 4,500 Deutschmark, and this 300 SL here 40,000 Deutschmark. A fortune at that time. This vehicle got designed in particular as a sports car. Over there, we have now uh, uh, another uh, sports vehicle, the 300 SLR. R should stand for race. And this vehicle got designed and developed in particular for the, in, uh, for the race events in the US, so-called so Pan-American.